Hello everyone, welcome to Sacred Gurukul. Today we are here uh, with one of the topper in NIC, Avijit Kharad. And first of all, congratulations on a being a scientist uh, at the Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah. So how did you celebrate at that day when the result came out? Uh, Actually, it was surprise for it went like a surprise for me as well because when the list ca came out, uh, just like a normal thing, I just press Control F and search my name, but I mm. didn't found my name there. And uh, later, fifteen to twenty minutes, uh, I mean, uh, okay, I was okay. Then okay, some time got wasted. We'll work on some other things now um, or some mm. other opportunities. But later, I searched for my friend's name. I didn't found that either. There are other two three known names. Okay. I didn't found those either. So it was not, it was a pictureized PDF. So I had, to, so control F is not working. So I had to search manually and then I saw my names later and it, mm -hmm. it went like a surprise for me. So that, that's it for me. So it's not like a big celebration. Are you expecting uh, you are going to qualify or not? Means uh, 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 my marks were good and interview went good as well. But uh, you can't expect uh, anything means so you expect something good in your since uh, in my BTEC days I used to think that I I will get selected in this company or like that but uh, I didn't got selected in those many companies as mm -hmm. I was open so you can't uh, expect properly mm -hmm. but I was feeling that everything is fine but uh, final result is final result. Okay, so, that's great. So can you tell me about your little bit about your education and about currently what are you doing any job or? Okay. Uh, my higher qualification is uh, MTech from IIT Patna. I did my MTech in 2019. Later, uh, and uh, after my MTech, only after two three months, this notification came in 2019. So since then, uh, after my MTech, only I was working in private firm. Since this two and two year and three four months, I'm working in private firms only. Mm -hmm. So uh, this is my education. And uh, you be taking from the computer science branch, right? Yes, yes. Uh, my BTEC is from computer science only. MTEC is also from computer science. Okay. But uh, MTEC subjects are not that relevant to what we uh, means expect in these exams. Means okay. These exams expect uh, quite conceptual questions, which are which, which we study in BTEC only. So yeah. MTEC was not supportive for that. Okay, that's a great. So uh, would you like to give credit to someone in your success uh, because this is a very big achievement for you. So any credit for any person? Uh, yes, means mainly I would like to th means give credit to my mom as uh, she was uh, a single single and she was a single parent and still she managed to uh, make good out of uh, three kids as a whole. And uh, uh, in my family, my sister also in because in my late education she stood uh, uh, stood for the responsibilities, and my uncles who help in kind of difficult situation. And friends are there, which give you idea about you are missing and give you idea about opportunities and help you out whenever you need. So uh, can you know a little more about your family, if you don't mind? Uh, I, my family contains uh, my mother and two sisters. So uh, my mother is basically a teacher and uh, older sister is a married. She work in a cadence in Pune only. And uh, uh, little sister, is a, she is a specially able kid. So she's 10 past right now. Okay, so uh, become a scientist in NIC. So motivation regarding where you will get the motivation or NIC. Okay. Okay. Actually, motivation uh, was like uh, motivation was for doing something good means doing something good for your society and uh, helping out in it, which we get uh, in our education like that feels means that was I was uh, hoping for since uh, I was kid, but later it went missing after BTEC that we have to earn money like that things happen. After joining private organization also you uh, improve in helping society, but uh, some other uh, the perks uh, get handled by some other bigger, bigger things and you don't feel that much satisfied. So here it is a direct impact. I thought like that and uh, I, I do so much current affair reading. So I, I know there are I guess, almost uh, more than two lakh women get missing every year. In India, and uh, yeah, uh, we know how much bribing I used to. I I still bribe so many police inspectors, and mm -hmm. how many 
things can be handled in government facilities with body cams those mm -hmm. things i felt and i thought uh, uh, nic can be a very big uh, source for helping this thing out so yes sir 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 so, uh, so uh, what are your strategy for the this exam uh, regarding the mains examination okay. or you can say the written examination and interview okay, frankly what are okay. the strategy is there any special okay. strategy or normally you are just actually uh, means uh, the uh, about nic i knew that uh, whatever i studied in btech mm -hmm. i have studied it good i have to revise it only uh, mm -hmm. so that revision was only my strategy but thing was uh, uh, the covid also hit in that much period so exam took more than a year to happen and uh, so and i was working in by then uh, so in those five days after working for eight hours you don't have that much of juice left to study so i didn't used to study at all in working days why i used to study on uh, weekend only that is also in sunday only uh, for 3 4 hours but uh, when uh, the examination day date was announced then it was like uh, you have to keep wake, keep your guards on uh, for whole saturday sunday and do revise one subject each, each day so i joined for a test series also online so mm -hmm. to stay in track so on sundays what i used to do i used to revise for 2 3 hours and give a test regarding it so so keeping track it was helpful so i joined a test series because i was afraid that by doing all, all this office works i will forget about in some days you will forget about that even you have filled the form so mm -hmm. also this can happen with st students also that you have assignments in lab exams you can forget mm -hmm. so to keep motivated you need test series and all this stuff. And so for interview uh, uh, one thing uh, uh, during the preparation uh, what was the most difficult part in your preparation difficult part as i mentioned uh, staying in continuous manner continuity is very difficult thing means you can study let's say i finished my data structure in uh, two weeks only you mm -hmm. get so much confidence confidence you get so much confidence later you missed out one one two month and you forget about database uh, subject as whole well also you have mm -hmm. to revise that again so continuity was a very difficult so i did a thing like that if i missed any sunday then i have to fill that those many hours of concentrated studies with the penalty hour also so like that it was not able to achieve every time but i tried as much as i can so okay that's great and uh, what about the interview and how are prepared for the interview okay interview came, came like a surprise to everyone i guess because means uh, everyone was expecting so many days are gone we uh, because after second wave uh, it was getting postponed so, so much and later interview date was announced interview went for with different batches it went for i guess 10 days and uh, i opened out i was in a first date only first day of interview was mine so uh, second day sorry second day and uh, i had almost two weeks in my hand and in my office also there was a uh, heavy session going on the release was in progress so uh, i had to manage after office hours 10 hours of office hours plus i had mm -hmm. to stay wake up those two weeks were difficult and i uh, joined one mock test uh, mock interview also there to just stay in a flow and get practiced out so that's it and i practice with my friends also those are also means good uh, there are iit uh, persons so as you told ki you are working in some private firm and you have already done the masters so uh, this thing helps in nic exam or not uh, no i won't means uh, actually it helped me for interview purpose only little bit for interview purpose but uh, in a written examination it won't help at all okay your practical knowledge won't help at all means uh, mm -hmm. the question you get in written examination are theoretical or numerical like but not applying your practical knowledge uh, so but interview it helps means uh, the interviewer ask what technology you have uh, worked on what impact you have made like this so there you can explore uh, explore your knowledge there and also uh, i i was able to explore my mtech knowledge was there also because i published papers so uh, it okay. gave me hand there and so interview you can manage with mtech and do your means uh, abhi one um, more question uh, there are many student who are not aware for this examination right so any message from your side actually 
till mtech first year i was also not aware of this kind of exams okay, okay. so okay so uh, it's uh, uh, it's uh, my suggestion to if anyone anyone is reading no, don't only learn about nic but uh, learn about uh, other notifications you get from or join any website which you give you notifications like those or keep on checking those websites uh, even all websites don't list all exams which can happen but keep on visiting them if you are in that phase your early phase so you don't miss out any opportunities because uh, in my btech only maybe my uh, means that conceptual basic knowledge was at peak level after joining industry it got a little bit low mm-hmm. so uh, if in that period if i had known i would have attempted it so, so, because problem. i saw lots of the student in the computer science branch also they are not aware for the government examination they are mm-hmm. only for the gate examination mm-hmm. and uh, basically they don't know ki nic is a terms and they are providing the government sector and class b officer uh, as a scientist post especially so that's why i asked this question so any special message or any other thing from your side ki uh, what the student get benefit from your message so it's a class 1 post ग्रुप ए क्लास वन फोर्स सो ए क्लास वन फोर्स साइंटिस्ट बी लेवल टेन ना या साइंटिस्ट या ग्रेड लेवल टेन सो सो यू सो दिस इज लाइक मींस ऑन द लेवल इट्स गोस टू सिमिलर एज आईएस ओके सो आईएस आईएफएस वर व्हाटेवर इन दैट डिपार्टमेंट इज अ टॉप मोस्ट पोस्ट सो यू आर एबल टू गेट दिस काइंड ऑफ बिगर पोस्ट विद द नॉलेज यू हैव गॉटन इन दोस 4 इयर्स ऑफ योर एजुकेशन दिस इज अ वेरी गुड थिंग फॉर यू Uh, like uh, that, rather than joining in means uh, it's your personal decision but uh, when joining in some low level jobs mean it's better for you as well regarding the application of it you put in society and also for your res- respect and reputation in your society so it's good because most of the student think is computer science don't have any government sector job that's why yes yes uh, I, i was i went through from same phase I means uh, i joined for btech in 2012 so in that period internet was not that much in scope I means i didn't even had a smartphone so mm-hmm. i didn't know what what i used to add that uh, if you want a government good engineering job you need to be from civil mechanical electrical uh, this four uh, uh, four means yeah, you see those four uh, core branches uh, only you should be or else you can't get any job but uh, later i have found out there are so many psu options as well so csc student don't have to be afraid that uh, i can't be there anyway in government jobs okay that's it so this is all about for today's interview so mm-hmm. is there any special message or any special thing from your side from my side this is completed uh, okay uh i would like to thank the, all those who were there as a part of me that means in my mock interviews in uh in my test series also and my friends who since i have practiced my interviews with friends as well so i would like to thank those all so it's thank you everybody abhijit for coming to an interview on the sacred guru pool and uh, those who are watching this video please like this video share this video and subscribe the channel and uh, say those students who are especially from the computer science branch not even the computer science branch other branches also can apply for the nic exam and that is in the coming in the ministry of electronics and yeah, information yeah, technology right okay yes yeah. so thank you everyone thank you abhijit okay. thank you so much